sure. So I'm assuming that you're trying to get ready for baby food or you have done it and you're just looking for a variety. Right now I'm about to make a butternut squash and some some of these uh, baby carrots from Publix. So I'm gonna wash them. And I'm, I'm probably going to give you some general stuff when it comes to baby food. So ba when it comes to baby food, one thing you need, the first thing you need to consider is your, <laughs> is um, the hygiene around your food prep. Make sure everything is clean. You know the, the the whatever you used to if you if you are like me I I I rarely use a dishwasher I I do my dishes in the sink so I have a separate a separate stuff for baby for baby food separate stuff for everybody else and I make sure that you know they don't the oil especially the grease and all that from from um, adult food doesn't get to the baby food yes mommy right so I'm gonna put this to boil and then I'll put this to boil and then I will I use a blender I use a regular blender a ninja blender I'll show you in a minute um, so and then on top of this I will put a fruit just to give it some natural sweetness because babies love sweet stuff for some reason a fruit like apple or pears mostly apple or pears he will finish the whole plate okay so I'm gonna put this to boil Okay, I didn't put all of it, so I'm going to keep this for later. And then, if if you with if you're trying to introduce baby food, one other thing is make sure your utensils, like his cup. Or oh, his or her cup and um, you know his bottles are sterilized if you don't have a sterilizer don't you worry I never bought one those things those are some of the things that you just you don't need a sterilizer like I said all you need is boiling water make sure your boiling water make sure your bottle sits in the boiling water for like a two minutes at least two minutes it can sit longer as long as it doesn't boil you know until all the water is out but just make sure that it boils for at least two minutes um what else make sure they are separate um the baby doesn't get stomach you know upsets with a good hygiene and besides that, um, I, I was told, or I was, somebody recommended gripe water. So just in case you're, you see that your baby is not um, getting those, not sitting well in your baby's stomach, you can give him some gripe water. Um, I'll show you one that I have. So 
so I have this I haven't used this so I can't really say whether it's good or not I started with this this is from Kenya <laughs> so I don't know how you're gonna get it but this is from Kenya and I used it since it was two weeks I used this and it's been working since then this one I got it from Walmart and is the best especially when I need my, when uh, my baby is getting constipated it got some ginger fennel chamomile lemon so you can uh, it helps with gas and it helps with stomach discomfort and it helps ease occasional constipation yes so I would use this and it really worked well I loved it none of this is sponsored so don't worry uh, it's not biased or whatever